Let's move on to talk about EFF structures themselves. We know that um, the EFF has released a statement to say that Andi Le Nkama and um, Kanisi Le Chabalala have had disciplinary action against them. You've asked that the media allow that to, to continue as an internal process. But what I want to ask you is many people have suggested that this is showing real cracks, real flaws in, in EFF structures. Will you talk to us about that? No, it's, uh, it's cracks in the individuals. It's not the cracks in the EFF. Uh, we have uh, <coughs> indeed as the leadership of the economic freedom fighters taken a decision to, uh, to, to take disciplinary action against those fighters. And I, you are correct that um, because that disciplinary process has been initiated, we want to give it a chance. We want to give it a space. It's an internal process. And therefore, it would be advisable that we, we sort of st stay away from expressing ourselves around their conduct because there's a disciplinary action that has been taken on them. And uh, allow that process to be exhausted and then the organizations uh, must, must deal with them the, the best way it believes. Uh, and, uh, and until such a time that the National Disciplinary Committee is able to, to comment uh, on the progress, on the verdict and so on and so forth, we are going to, to sort of stay away and, uh, and allow that process to, to unfold. Now, our social media followers had quite a few questions to ask you on Twitter and on Facebook. If you don't mind, we're going to, to pose those questions yeah, to you. Uh, before we move on, I think but what, what is important to emphasize is that um, none of those disciplinary actions uh, are going to deter the, the EFF uh, from doing and executing its work as excellently as it's been doing. Uh, the, the type of robust representation that we've been doing in Parliament party work, constituency work, organizational work continues because the leadership of the EFF as elected in Mangawung remains united, remains solidly uh, behind the program uh, of the economic freedom fighters. So we're, we're, we're continuing and, the, and, and it's important to, to put that on record that uh, the, the disciplinary action as to, with regards to these fighters uh, is not a reflection at all that uh, you know there'll be work that is not done. Work continues at it, as it has been continuing, uh, and and but we want to give the disciplinary process, you know, a chance and space.